In today's video, I'm going to be making this cool Mother's Day vase. I had this old log that was drying out for about two years now, so I decided to use it. I cut a piece out of it that was eight inches long. So once I cut that, I started turning it. I just wanted to remove the bark to get a basic shape. All right, there's our basic shape. Now I'm starting to shape the vase a little bit better. You can see, I tried drilling the hole for it. This worked before, but for some reason it didn't work this time. You can see it just keeps on failing. Anyways, I decided to drill the hole later, so for now I just sanded it. There's this cool trick I came up with where you can hold a piece of sandpaper with a chisel, that way you don't get your finger in a dangerous spot. Now it was time to drill the hole. I used a one inch Forstner bit for this. All right, so now it's the next day and it's time to try out my pyrography skills. Let's see if I can... I use this cool leaf tip to get a cool heart effect. If you line up two just right, you could get a cool shape. Now I just sanded it gently. I didn't want to remove too much of the burn marks, but I did want to remove the extra that I didn't want there if that makes sense. I switched over to this uh, pointy tip to do the letters, as well as the stems for the flowers. Then I went back to the leaf tip to add, well, the leaves to each flower. I used two different ways, one that looks sort of like a sunflower, and then one that looks like your traditional cartoony flower. Then it was time to coat the inside of the hole so that it could hold in the water when you water the flower, yes. So I went ahead and mixed up some alumilite resin, about 30 milliliters, which was way too much, but I poured it in and then I started coating the inside edges as well as the top rim. So I got a nice, cool coating. Look at that. After cutting out the waste pieces, it still didn't sit quite flat. So I cut a piece of automobile carpet just to give it a little better place to stand on. Then I added two coats of fast drying semi-gloss polyurethane and it was ready. Look at that, it turned out great. I think, and it's perfect for Mother's Day, so it's a bit late, but maybe you could do it in one day, I don't know. I just started kind of late, so um, if you try this, good luck. <laughs> 